Hi friends, in this video I will be showing you how to do overclocking in ASUS Rockstrix RTX 3090 graphics card. So first of all, we will download the GPU, make three software and uh, from the ASUS site. So first you need to have to go to the uh, Google and you have to type ASUS Quick 3, okay, GPU Quick 3, okay. If you click over here, then you need to go to the GPU Quick software, uh, the first thing over which appears. And then just scroll down over here. You can also click over here, but it's better that you scroll down. And here you will find the latest uh, the software which is available. So right now here the version is 1.3.5.7 is available. So just click on download. And uh, just click on download. But I have already downloaded this software. And it's already there in my program files. And it's a uh, small small software of some TNB of size is only. So, first you need to download the software. Once you have downloaded and installed the software, then you need to open the software. Okay. And uh, oh, this is the software. Hmm, so, here as you can see, this is my software. Um, GPU Tweak 3. So, here you can see all the different modes, all the different ones that are for mode, one is the oxygen mode, one is the silent mode, and here you can use your own, uh, own uh, custom, custom settings. Okay, if you click on the default mode, you can see the settings. The power setting is 100%, GPU boost log is 1860 MHz, memory clock is 19,500 uh, and 2 MHz, and fan speed is uh, set to auto. In the OC mode, if you click, you can see. The GPU where the power is 105 percent, GPU power is 8090, and as you can see here, here are the settings. So, if you click on this default default settings, you will get a hash rate of around 105, something around 105. Okay, and your power temperature will, as you can see over here, it is 388 watt, and the temperature of uh, of your GPU is 66, 60, 60, and the temperature of your memory. Uh, uh, of your memory clock is uh, of your memory is 100. So this is not efficient in case of mining. Okay. So what we will do? I will create a. I will create my own file over here. As you can see that I have already created my file 3090 OC mode. Okay. So you can click. Uh, do so you can click on add new. You can click on add new and you can create your own mode. Okay. So once you have done this, once you have done this. You will, then you need to change your power target. You change your power target to 88. Okay, just lower it to minus 12. Relieve, relieve GPU voltage as it is. And uh, here, GPU in, uh, in case of uh, GPU boost clock, lower it to minus 186. Okay, keep it to 1674 megahertz. And the memory clock, and in case of memory clock, you increase it to uh, 22,602 megahertz. That is, you have to increase it to around 3100. Okay. And keep the fan speed to 90 90% of both of both the fans. Uh, okay, and this is the thing you will just save the settings. Once you will save the settings, you will see that your you will see that your hash rate has increased to 186, 126, sorry, 126 megahash mega damage per second. Okay, see as you can see over here, you have, uh, you, my hash rate is around 126. Okay, so this is a setting which you have to do. And uh, one important thing to note here is that if you increase your memory clock uh, to more than this, like uh, 3200, 3300, or more than this, it might be possible that your GPU may get unstable, okay? it will get crash. So it's better that you uh, keep the memory clock around 3100 or 3000, okay? And it will also help you to uh, keep your memory RAM temperature to around 100 degrees Celsius. In my case, as you can see, it is around 104 degrees Celsius, but uh, this should not, not be there. Okay, it it has to be below 100 for uh, for so that you get a longer life, longer GPU life. So I will uh, I will try to keep this uh, temperature to go below 100 degrees Celsius, and uh, by installing some cooling systems uh, in a few, uh, in, a, in a day or two. So this is the thing. So you need to lower it to uh, keep it below 100. It will be better for your GPU. Uh, so guys, uh, this is the overall clock, overclock settings which I have done and it is quite stable for me, around 3100, uh, I have increased it, uh, the memory clock to 3100, so it is quite stable 
and you can see that I am getting the hash. I am getting the hash rate of 126.47 mh per second. And uh, even you can see one more thing. You can see that my power consumption is only 342 watt. If I will set to default mode, then I will not get uh, even the hash rate of 126. It will be around 105, and my uh, power consumption will be 388 around 388 to 390. So here I am getting dual benefit. One one thing is that I am getting the hash rate, uh, 20 hash rate more than from the default mode, and uh, even my power consumption has reduced around to 40 to 40, 50 degrees, uh, 40 to 45 watts. Okay, so this is very big, uh, beneficial for me. Um, so you can also try this uh, OC settings in your graphics card. So that's it for now, and uh, uh, please do like and share my video. And uh, subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed yet. And thanks for watching. Bye.